Hello and welcome back. There is a special magic in the air. Can you feel it? The days are getting shorter, the breeze is cooler and the world around us is transforming into a canvas of rich and warm colors. Autumn is here. Autumn is all about creating a warm, inviting space where we can relax and unwind as the days get cooler and we spend more time indoors. In my home, this living area becomes the most used room in the house. So I was planning to give this space a well-deserved deep clean to make it ready for the upcoming winter months. And I guess it's time to give my cushions some extra love as they became flat and lost their fluff over the time. A simple but effective trick to revive them is to let them sit outside under the sun. Fresh air and sunlight are natural and gentle way to restore their shape. Adding few fresh lavender leaves is also an excellent way to make our home smell good. In case you don't have a lavender plant at home, you can also try the store bought one. I simply let it air dry and then place them in a small muslin or cotton bags in drawers, closets or even under our pillows. While the cushions were drying out, I decided to make use of some leftover oranges by creating dried orange slices in the oven. Not only do they smell amazing, but they also bring a beautiful natural touch to your autumn decor. I started with cutting thin slices. You want them to be even so they dry at the same rate. Plus, thinner slices dry more easily and end up looking beautifully translucent. Next, I laid the orange slices on a baking tray. Make sure to spread them out so they are not overlapping. This allows them to dry evenly and prevents any soggy spots. As the orange slices were drying, the kitchen was filled with the incredible scent of oranges, bringing a lovely dose of freshness to the entire house. While the oranges were drying, I decided to deep clean my sofa as I spotted some food stains on it earlier. I made my cleaning solution by adding a washing pot to some warm water. The warmth helps dissolve the pot easily and I also added a bit of fabric conditioner to leave the fabric feeling soft and smelling fresh. Next, I grabbed a microfiber cloth and soaked it in the cleaning solution. Now here is a little trick. I used a glass lid and wrapped the microfiber cloth around it to wipe down the sofa with ease. After the cushions are cleaned, I will let them air dry for a while before placing them back. Rugs are a wonderful way to make any room feel cozy, but they also tend to collect odors over time, especially in high traffic areas. To eliminate any lingering smell, I will simply use baking soda which is a natural deodorizer and it's perfect for tackling the odors that get trapped in your rug fibers. Isn't it amazing how something so simple can make such a big difference in keeping your space clean and fresh? Another important tip if you got an open kitchen like mine is to deep clean the countertop time to time. After all, regularly deep cleaning your kitchen countertop isn't just about keeping surfaces spotless. It also plays a vital role in eliminating odor sources and maintaining a hygienic, pleasant and inviting space at home. I recently bought these beautiful sugar and tea jars and I have been waiting for the right moment to place them on the kitchen countertop. Now that the house is smelling so fresh and inviting, I decided to place them on the countertop today. Little touches like these can make such a big difference. Me 
After drying the orange slices, I realize it's really important to keep the temperature low, even lower than originally I thought. I set my oven to 120 Celsius but after trying it, I realized that 80 to 90 Celsius would be ideal for a lower and more gentle drying process. So there were few burnt slices but I guess not everything always goes perfectly when you try it for the first time. One big smile across my face We used to dance our way to church on Sundays Mama set the pace Daydreamer I found this beautiful vibrant block print cushion covers recently and I just knew they would be the perfect touch to live in up the space now, here is a simple secret to make your cushions smell as cozy as they look. Essential oils. All you need are a few drops of your favorite essential oil and few cotton pads. Take a cotton pad and carefully add few drops of the essential oil to it. Now tuck them into the cushion cover. Once the cushion covers are zipped up, no one will even know it's there. But you will enjoy the subtle comforting fragrance every time you sit on your couch. Take me back, all the way back to the... After vacuuming the rug and fluffing up the sofa cushions, I like to use a fabric spray to finish everything off. It simply adds a light pleasant fragrance that makes the entire space feel even more inviting. Show me what it's like to be circling among the clouds Because without you by my side I would be stuck here on the ground You're An autumn makeover wouldn't be complete without giving the dining area a cozy upgrade. This beautiful table cover brings that perfect warm fall vibe into the space. Sometimes adding a few drops of your favorite fragments can make all the difference. It's a quick easy way to create a lovely inviting scent right before guests arrive or just when you want your home to feel extra special. Just a few sprays around the edges of the tablecloth will do the trick. And at last but not the least, adding some mix of colorful fresh flowers. They add not just beauty but also a delightful fragrance that can brighten up any area. To wrap up the autumn makeover to this living area, I made my own DIY potpourri. Here are the star ingredients. Coarse salt which helps to absorb and release scents. Cloves, dried lavender leaves for a calming aroma and these beautiful dried orange slices for a hint of citrus freshness. You can also light up your favorite scented candle to enhance the scent even further. Feels like I can fly. I don't need anybody. I don't need anybody. Just look at how colorful and fragrant it is. Take me. No one will ever take me. The combination of these ingredients created a wonderful natural potpourri that instantly brightened up this space. I love how these simple home available ingredients instantly gave this space those cozy autumn vibes. It's the little things that make our home feels warm and inviting, especially as the weather cools down. Fresh flowers don't just look good, they also uplift your spirit. Thanks for joining me today. If you enjoyed this cozy transformation and want more ideas for creating a warm home, don't forget to like and subscribe. I can't wait to see you in the next video. Take care. See you next time.